Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are all doing well for today's video. It's a pretty exciting video. I haven't done a furniture makeover in such a long time, but today I'm gonna to be making over my dining room table. Now this table is almost 10 years old. It does have two leafs to it to make it a lot bigger where I can sit about like 14, 16 people. But as you guys can see, it's that old cherry wood color. There is some scratches and some dents around it, but I'm really excited to give it a brand new look. And today I'm gonna to be using the Dwell Wood Furniture Paint. So Dwell Paint's a really neat online company that has a ton of different paints for any project that you can think of. And the paint I am using today is a water-based paint that has little to no odor. So that is perfect. I don't have to open my windows or a ventilator or anything. And I'm using the color white. I absolutely love using white around my house. I have a lot more gray and neutral tones. So this dark cherry color has to go. First up in this little kit, you have this little tape down tarp, which is perfect to protect your floors. You have a wooden stick to help stir up your paint, some gloves, which is really nice to protect your hands. You have a foam roller and also a paintbrush. And then this paint is also 32 ounce container that covers up to 50 to 60 square feet. And it's actually a really nice paint. It honestly almost reminds me of like a chalk paint consistency, which is really easy to work with. And then also has some instructions of like things you can do with it, how to paint and all that kind of stuff. So that's really nice that they do include that into this kit. So first up, I'm gonna go ahead and put down this tape down tarp. And I really like this because it's not gonna move around like other tarps do and it opens up pretty easy and it's also really easy to get rid of. So that's perfect. I'm just doing it basically all around the entire table. And then something else I also like to do, if it comes to like tables or cabinets i like to put a plastic plate under there too just to catch like any drippings or just so i kind of don't make a really big mess under it but i'm gonna go ahead and get this paint ready so just rip up the seal give it a good shake and then i'm gonna go ahead and also stir it So like I mentioned in the kit, it came with a paintbrush or a foam roller. So I prefer to use the paintbrush. I like the fact that with the paintbrush, you do have more control of how much paint that you wanna apply. And you can also see some of the brush strokes where it's gonna look more of like that distressed look compared to the foam roller. So the foam roller, obviously you're gonna have a more smoother kind of finish to it. So I decided to use the paintbrush. I'm basically just gonna go ahead and apply the first coat through here and Guys, this paint's pretty thick. A little bit goes a long way. So I did forget to mention, you guys won't be seeing me paint the two leaves to the table. I honestly completely forgot to film that for you guys. It just kind of like slipped my mind. When I'm in the mode of like painting and like in that creative mindset, I sometimes forget to move my camera. <laughs> so <laughs> please excuse that. You guys aren't gonna see that. So this is how the table is looking like so far with one coat. Now you guys can see in the certain areas, it is a little bit more brighter because the paint is still wet. So I'm gonna go ahead and let the table dry for probably about like two to three hours before I jump back into it. Oh, stop. Can't 
believe I live in your thoughts I think about you all the time Morning, evening and midnight Such a wonderful delight Forgo Give up everything that I Unexpected love was found You're the rose in a garden I am loving how this is turning out so far. I have been wanting for such a long time to paint this table white and I was so, always so scared to do it, but I finally bit the bullet and decided to just jump right into it. And this paint is perfect because you don't have to use a sealer. And that's what's really nice. It does have a nice protective coating on it. It is scratch resistant and dent resistant. So that's definitely a plus if you have kids and you're worried about them like damaging your tables. It is so easy to clean it. It honestly feels like a nice heavy duty like sealer or finish is on it once it's dry. The world around could pass us by a thunderstorm, a lightning strike as we hold each other tight. You're the rose in a garden and it shows if I'm So here is a completed piece and guys, I absolutely love it. I am so happy with it. It just turned out absolutely perfect and goes very well with my home. But I will be sure to leave a link down below in my description box to Dwell Paint for you guys to check out for your painting needs. And if you guys are new to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Give this video a big thumbs up and I will see you guys next time.